After an excruciating trip down sex education lane, Michelle and Mama D finally arrive at the wedding venue where Aunt Brenda has been waiting for half an hour. This is one of the top venues in the city of Detroit. I mean, this is a very high level place. And when Michelle becomes very selfish and doesn't care about others' time, that is a reflection of not only her, but me. I have a relationship with the people here and I don't want to damage that. You all think I got time to waste. I have a business to run. I don't have time to sit here and wait on you all. You are a half hour And late. you're gonna wait until we get here. Can we get to business? time, it's not your time. Yes, it babe. is, yes it is. Let's be malicious, go on through that though. Go find something you can bedazzle. I am mad at my aunt because she's doing this for free and she thinks she's doing me a favor. Suck it up. You're not doing me a favor, you're doing your job. And it looks like even a venue walkthrough is going to be work with these two. Hi, how are you? Good. I'm sorry we're late. It's okay. Hi. Hi. So, we're, we're cleaning up from last night. We had an event for 400 people. Oh, you're people. cleaning up? This should have already been cleaned up, baby. That's unexcusable. You don't own the building, mother. We paying enough to rent it. We're not renting uh -uh, it today. Oh, no. Oh, this should have been gone. Right now, I feel like my mom is understanding that it's about me, and she has my back over my aunt's back. I think that's it. Think uh, no, 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 no. You need to ask for the bride, the groom. That's my problem. That's not for her to determine. Uh, that means she know doesn't that. know yet. That means she doesn't know yet. That means she doesn't know yet. She ain't did that part yet. Did they just high five to ignorance? Mama D encourages Michelle's behavior because Mama D was a brat growing up. And her mom is telling her, you are this, you are that, you're the princess. It's all about you, you get what you want. But she's living vicariously through Michelle because she didn't have the wedding she wanted. If you weren't family, <laughs> I'd quit this job.